Ten years ago, measles killed nearly half a million children per year. But with a decade of work, a global partnership of organizations has cut the deaths in Africa by 92%. Sound good? It is. Except now their funding has been cut by more than 75% since 2007. International headlines show a scary trend emerging. Since June 2009, more than 30 African countries have experienced measles outbreaks. Experts are forecasting a resurgence that could erase a decade of work. So why is such a successful program left begging for funds? Well, here's one answer. People like me, regular people, don't know enough about this. It's not that they don't care. They just don't know that the funding has been cut. They don't know that it costs only 26 cents for this vaccine. So fixing that became my goal, to raise awareness, to make my community a model of measles fundraising, so that other people, other communities, would be inspired and join us. I asked for help from my family, from my friends and my classmates. We formed a nonprofit, put on bake sales at my college. My classmates made posters and flyers. They baked cupcakes and wrote articles for the student newspaper. We talked to other schools and found a class of fourth graders to work with. Our global health professor volunteered her time to work with us as we taught the kids about the immune system and about the variables that affect health outcomes. They taught other classrooms at their school about measles, and the whole school raided their piggy banks to try and raise enough money to inoculate two villages in this fall's vaccination campaign in Ghana. The kids put on lemonade stands. They went to farmers markets. They went door to door educating their neighbors about measles. We designed an interactive donation box to raise money for vaccines. We're placing these in doctor's offices all around Seattle this summer and fall. And in September, I'll be traveling to Ghana to film and meet some of the kids who are being inoculated and to try to capture firsthand the good that is coming from the Global Measles Initiative. To highlight for other schools, other youth organizations, other communities, that even a small group of kids can create lasting outcomes for thousands of others. I may not have millions of dollars, but I do have 26 cents. And so does my girlfriend, so do my friends, so do my roommates, so do people all around me every day. And so this is what our community is doing to reduce deaths under five, 26 cents at a time.